It's Wee Wow Week. Right on Houston. Hello and welcome back to Wee Wow. A hands-on crash course in Fun Fun 101 for the science seekers and inventoritos everywhere. I'm Mindy. And I'm Guy Raz. And it's Hello Wow Week here in the Wee Wow Laboratory of Bad Ideas. That's right. Today's episode is all about screaming, something that I personally excel at. Yes, you do, Mindy. It's called screaming for science. What that scream really means. Ah! Ah! What in the... Just screaming for science, Guy Raz. <sighs> and with that, we've got a screaming for science experiment for you. We call it the screaming balloon. And in this experiment, you'll discover a few things you probably didn't know about the science of sound. You'll also drive your grown-ups bonker balls. Okay, let's get started. For this experiment, you'll need only two types of materials. Balloons. Floppy ones. And a handful of hex nuts. Like the little metal kind you find at the hardware store. And now for the wow two. Step one, start with one balloon and one hex nut. Okay, I've got mine here. Okay, now you're going to squeeze the hex nut through the mouth of the balloon. Make sure it goes all the way into the balloon so you don't accidentally suck it out when you're blowing up the balloon in step number two. Step number two, blow the balloon and tie it off. <gasps> Uh, Mindy? Uh, and uh, be careful not to overinflate the balloon or it'll explode. Oopsie! Uh, don't worry, Guy Raz. I'll inflate another one. Don't faint, Mindy. <gasps> ah! Whoops! Whew, okay. Once you manage to inflate your balloon without popping it, tying off the end of the balloon, there we go. Then we can move on to step three. Grasp the neck of the balloon or the knotted end with one hand and swirl it in a circular motion. Swirl, 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 swirl. The hex nut might bounce around at first, but soon it'll begin to roll around inside of the balloon. Step four. Once the hex nut begins to spin, use your other hand to stabilize the balloon. Your hex nut should continue to spin for 10 seconds or more. And now for step five, the final step. Listen. What's that sound? A hex nut has six sides, and these flat edges cause the hex nut to bounce or vibrate against the inside wall of the balloon. Whoa, it sounds so cool. It almost sounds like <gasps> a screaming balloon. Amazing! Wowzers, we would love to see pictures and videos of your screaming balloons. You can upload them to us and find more detailed instructions on today's Wee Wow Tinkering Challenge at tinkercast.com slash wee wow. Happy Hallow Wow! <laughs>